I need to put in my Instagram bio in order to get a lot of followers and be Instagram famous? I'm gonna tell you all about that today. Let's do this. Oh, hi there. My name is Lou Levy and in this channel, I teach you everything you need to know to just kill it in social media. To be huge on the internet and to get insta famous. So, if that's what you want, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And today, I will tell you what you need to have in your Instagram bio to make sure that everyone who finds your profile follows you and to make sure that you get found on Instagram. Plus, I will tell you how to do line breaks, emojis, and just get that bio like gorgeous looking, all right? So, first, Let's talk about what needs to be in your bio, and then we'll talk about how to make it look awesome, all right? First things first. When you go and edit your profile, you will see that the very first option you have to edit is your name. Now, most people would put here, you know, their names because that's just self-explanatory, but that's wrong. What you should put here is what you do. Unless you're like Kim Kardashian, super famous. Why? Well, all right, so let's say that you are an Instagram expert and that you're constantly giving Instagram tips, all right? It is quite possible that people will search for Instagram tips, and if they do, chances are my profile will show up eventually. Now, if I put in Luciana Levy as my name and people are searching for Instagram tips, they certainly will not find me. So that's a really effective tip to get found on Instagram, which is one of the hardest things to do. So, name, tell me what you do. Instagram tips, social media expert, photographer, architect, doesn't matter. That's where you put what you do. And that will show up in the very first line of your bio. So it's not only the first thing people see, but it's also the thing that people will search for. Now, in the second line of your, of your bio, that's where your name goes. And you're gonna fill that out on the first line of that space where you have to fill in your actual bio. So it's gonna be the second thing that shows up on your profile bio but it'll be the first thing that you're gonna put in the little text box all right so that's where you put your name the third thing that people will need to know about you is where you're from where do you live guys this is so important people often forget to put their locations but let's say you're looking for an Instagram expert you're looking for Instagram consulting and I I forget to tell you where I am let's say I live in Japan you live in New York I won't be able to take care of you because we're gonna be a whole half a world away crazy time zones so that's just gonna like mess everything up all right so if I say I'm in Sao Paulo you're in New York and we have like the same time zone everything's gonna work out if you're an influencer and you live in New York and a brand is putting together an event and they're looking for influencers to invite let's say they go into your profile and you just don't say where you are they might not invite you because they just don't know you're from New York so, really important to put where you are in the world so that you can get more clients, get more invitations, get more brand deals. Please, guys, all right? So, third thing in your bio, that's where you are. And fourth thing that you must have in your Instagram bio is a call to action. So, I make videos on YouTube on how to be Instagram famous. So, on my bio, I just put in real big letters, be Instagram famous with a little hand pointing down like that so that people will know that when they click in that link, they will find out how to be Instagram famous. Now, you can put your website, you can put your email, like, email me for consulting prices, whatever. Just make sure you tell people what you want them to do and that's what goes in last on your Instagram bio. Now, since we're here talking about Instagram and Instagram bio and Instagram tips and everything about Instagram, Let's take a minute here to pause this video, go to your Instagram, and follow me at lou.levy. Follow? All right, let's continue. <laughs> All right, now, for a very long time, Instagram did not permit line breaks in that bio section where you edit. Um, I just tried to do it, and for some reason it worked. So I'm not sure if that was an update or if I just got lucky and, or, or not lucky because I was trying to show you guys how you can't do that, but you can. So anyway, I'm gonna show you this website where you can do your line breaks in case you can't do it 
in, in case you can't figure out how to do it on, in the actual Instagram app. And also in the same website, you're gonna find out how many characters you have in your bio because you have a total of 150 character limit for your bio. So you have to use them wisely. All right, so go into wordcounter.net and type in your bio right there. So you can include your emojis, you can do your line breaks, you can make everything really cute and funny and colorful and use emojis that really represent you here. As you do that, you can see how many characters you've used so that you can be sure that you have all these four items in your bio. What are they again? what you do, what your name is, where you live, and what you want that person to do, all right? And now, here's a little tiny tip. Let's say you're running low on characters and you've got all these emojis, like you've got the high five emojis and you've got the hands up emoji and you've got the selfie emoji. Well, see, all these emojis have the option of changing the skin tone and those emojis actually take up two characters because there's a command in there that shows up. This is the emoji that they want and they also want it in this color. So it takes up two characters. Now, if you just go back and put that same emoji in the generic people color, which is yellow for some reason, it's fine, you'll see that that only takes up one character. So if you're very low on character count, just make sure that you go back to the generic yellow skin and you'll save up some space with that. So let me know here in the comment section how many characters is in your bio because people just have so much trouble with it. I know I'm always like, oh, I need to get rid of two, char two characters. So let me know what your biggest difficulty in shortening up your, your bio was and how many characters your bio actually turned out to be. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you like the content, if you want to be Instagram famous, if you just want to kill it on social media, all right? And if you like it, make sure to tell your friends. And I will see you guys on Instagram, at lou.levy. Beijo!